Okay, part 10. The time has come for the rocking of this bitch. Alright, so uh, I'm going to be heading to the... Uh, what is it called? The Underground Gallery area to fight the Twin Dragon Zombie, where we'll get the next ability, the Heavy Ring, which will allow us to push heavy objects such as the giant crates that have been in our way. So let's uh, get that done with. Um, man, do I have to go down this way? Let's not do that, huh? I'm just trying to figure out if there's a better way to do this. You know, actually... You know what? It's easier to access it from the other side of the Eternal Corridor. So let me go back. It's actually... I mean, it's close to there, but it's easiest to access. There's not that many warps in this game, too. There's only, like, five warps. And I already have three of them, so... Yeah, let me, uh... Do this. I believe I gotta go... Yeah, okay. This way. Oh, let's take care of this guy first. He's the more immediate threat. I don't think so. Homie, well, we don't play that. Damn. Get come on, Nathan. Snap out of it. <laughs> Whip it good. Just grab that. Alright. <laughs> yeah, it's easiest to access from here. Actually, I think this might be the only way to access it. Now that I think of it. The underground gallery. <laughs> yeah, there's another way to go in, but you'd need the heavy ring. So, you know, doored. These little imps are a pain in the ass. Alright. Oh, can't do anything there. Alright, I can get the heart. Alright, first let me go down this way. Wait, what does this do? This reverse? Oh, that makes that thing come. Okay. Yeah, it was really pointless. Okay. Oh, I know what you're supposed to do. Can I do this? Let's see. This isn't easy, but... Let's see if I can make this happen. Oh, yeah. And get a heart smack out of that. Now let's go this way. Oh, that's blocked off also. Nothing I can do about that. So there's only one way to go, then. That heavy ring will open up all those crate areas. I'll be able to push the crates out of the way. Somebody said, you know, yeah, you can break rocks, but you can't push a crate. Well, the rocks are cracked, so the crates are just really heavy. The crates are actually sturdy. Those rocks are full of cracks. Ah. These harpies... In any Castlevania game, they're a pain in the ass. But I think they're especially bad in this one. Because they immediately go to shooting those feathers everywhere, you know. Hold on. There's an area up here, but uh, I can't do anything about that now, can I? Not unless I got an, a harpy over there and turned it to stone, which I might want to try and do that. So let me... I think I would normally need the Rook Wing, but let me try and do this. Ah, dang. It was in the, it was in the perfect position, and I had to screwed up like that. I don't know if this is going to be possible, but... Oh, almost. Come on. Ah, really? Oh, because I slipped off like a friggin' noob? Alright, come on. <laughs> no, don't hit it there. 
I need you a little higher than that. Nope. Alright, not, not over there, though. Oh, yeah! There's even more, though, which I can't... I don't have... What? Let's see if I can't... Yeah! Oh, man, really? I could probably get up there. That lizard man just kind of put me back down, though. I need that harpy to come down here again. There we go. Unf! How sweet was that? It's not quite a sequence break, but that was pretty badass. So I'm not really supposed to get up there, but, you know, I saw a way around it. Alright, wait, okay, let's see. Where now? <laughs> uh, okay, up first, because I think there's a save point up there. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Save point. Alright, then down to the bottom. Man, oh man, oh man. Crazy, crazy. Do 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 Stupid death mantis. Just want to get these moths out of the way, too. I think their dust turns you to stone or poisons you. Pretty sure it turns you to stone. And you die. Alright, where the hell am I now? Um, okay. I think I want to just go straight across for now. Whoa, hello. Nice. That worked out nicely. Oh! I thought you would shoot. I didn't think you'd do that. That was a little overkill, but hey, I got another hard ring. That's okay, I like my kind of current configuration with the one hard ring and the one strength ring. Stylish suit. Let's see about that. Uh, that would be up here. Stylish suit. No good, no good. I don't want that. I just want better armor. Is that so much to ask for? Armor's not important in this game as it is in, like, you know, like Symphony. Your level's more important in this. Oh. Alright, so this is some extra magic. Let's just get it to the other side. I'm not too comfortable there. Okay. Oop. Bastitch. Oh, yeah, level up. Level the full level am I by the way? Level 23, I'm doing good. Bash. The problem with knowing your way through the game, I mean there's there's pros and cons. The pro is if you know your way through the game, you get through it quickly, and you're better you know, you're better at it because obviously you have more experience playing. But the problem is is less wandering around, therefore less fighting enemies and grinding up your levels, so you tend to be weaker. Alright. But I'm doing pretty good. Alright. Ooh, I don't want the dagger. It's, it's gay. Alright. Oh, killer bees. I got poisoned. Let me see about fixing that. Uh. Oh. Man eaters. I was just thinking, too, um... Oh, damn. I haven't gotten any cards in a while, but I'm not a, making a big deal out of that, to be honest. Oh, poison armor, isn't it? Hey. 
I didn't want to collect that until the guy was dead, but hey, I got an antidote out of it. Alright. I don't want to unpoison myself till I'm away from all these freaking guys that can poison me. There's nothing worse than using an antidote and then getting poisoned right away. Uh-oh. Oh. I knew that was coming, and yet I did not get out of the way. I underestimated his length. There we go. Slide under, jump over. Gotcha. Or now I'm gonna use an antidote. And a potion. Okay, so... Just to ooh, see where I'm standing here, I'm gonna go... Wow, there's only one choice. That was kind of silly. Oh, more of these fuckwads. I guess I'm just gonna take it slow here and watch out for the bees. Come on, I know it's coming. Or maybe not. Maybe he changed his mind, I don't know. Well, wow, they're really fucking throwing these fucking daggers at me, aren't they? Uh oh, ah shit. Alright. Don't think I have another. Oh, I do, I do have one more antidote. This is the easiest of many, is because I can just stand and whip them. Oh man, oh man. Okay. Oh, my canids. Just a Minox, you know? I'm chewing on the power cables. There we go. Woo! That's a heart. Let me just figure out where I'm... Okay, um... I believe up and to the right. You can go up and to the left, but that dumps you out into the other area that I was in before. And I would need the, uh... It didn't work out the way I wanted it to, but... Ah, fungal. Too low on hit points to bother with these guys. I gotta get to the save point that's nearby. That's just great when that happens. I'm so glad that happens. I'm in trouble here. I am I'm in deep shit. There we go. Oh, hallelujah, bitch tits. That's right, I said hallelujah, bitch tits. <sighs> I'm very close to the boss. I could, you know what? I mean, I can do it in this fucking video. How crazy is that? I'm, I'm like right here. He's tough though, so let's see. You really don't want to fuck with these guys too much. Just crosses, crosses. Ah. I was kind of hoping I... Oh! The whole neck hurts you, but the rest of it that looks like a giant turtle doesn't. Kelanophilia, baby. Ooh. The fact that there's two of them is kind of a... a bitch. Oh, well. Oh. That didn't work out the way I wanted it to, but hey. I really want to concentrate on only one at a time.
Sucks that I wasn't maxed for hearts, though. Dang. You die already, you fuck nugget. No. <laughs> Hey, it's one down, and I leveled. Oh, he feeds on the other one. Shit, I forgot about that. I don't know how many times he can do that, though. I find this one to be a little easier just simply because you have more room to work with once the other guy's gone. I don't know how many crosses left, and if I keep missing, it's gonna suck ass. Come on, guy. It's like he's bleeding purple goop from his leg there. That's the last cross I can throw. Well, actually, no. I could. I can use some. It's not a lot of hearts, but I'll get a couple of crosses out of it. Come on, guy. It's easier to stay out of his way once one of them is dead, you know? Oh, that was stupid. Boy, am I in trouble now. Alright. for one more cross. Oh, and I throw it the wrong way. Oh well. Didn't even get him on the rebound. And yeah, I could probably hit him more, more often if I stand on the platform, but it's less safe. It's more safe over here because I could run to the right if I need to. This video's getting long, but I wanted to get the boss battle in there. I've been lucky with those rocks not falling on me. It's pretty cool. Come on already. Yeah, I know you're coming down. Yeah, I win. Ah, uh, you suck. I rule. Well, I gotta stop right here because the video got long. But uh, that's uh, Castlevania Circle of the Moon Part 10. And I'll see you tomorrow with more Castlevania goodness.